As coronavirus cases continue to increase, testing for COVID-19 is ramping up both locally and regionally. Gunderson Health System in La Crosse and also Mayo Clinic Health System in Rochester are trying to gain a better understanding of COVID-19 so they can figure out who has the disease and also the best way to fight it. News 8 Now's Tyler Job has a story. It will be a while before COVID-19 begins tapering off. So hospitals, both locally and regionally, are speeding up their testing to keep pace with the deadly disease. Carolyn Flock says infectious disease experts are forming a research task force in Rochester. So they've broken it out into, I believe, 10 different um, categories of research. Drug trials with several types of antivirals, including State one touted by President Trump, are being conducted as part of that group. The, probably the most commonly or best known one is uh, uh, I think it's for invested here. Dr. Michael Joyner says more research needs to be done before conducting larger trials. The final thing is to actually enroll people in trials where where one patient, one group of patients receives a placebo or a control therapy while the other actually receives the drug, plasma or, or other intervention. Flock says clinical trials usually take up to six months. And whereas they have already activated six clinical trials through this research task force, um, in a matter of a couple of weeks. Every time a trial opportunity is coming through, they're, they're trying to assess um, each region of the Mayo Enterprise, lacrosse included, and how we can bring that trial here. Researchers at Gunderson Health System have already been doing genome sequencing. The genome itself is, is basically the long message, the instruction manual on how to make one of these viruses. So we've been able to analyze all of that from about 21 of our patients so far in the lab. Dr. Pora Kenny says Gunderson is planning to conduct antibody testing in the coming weeks and months. They should be able to tell us who has already had the virus. But in order for our lives to get back to normal, Kenny says that will happen when the time is right. Once we know that, that there's a, a good number of people who have already been infected and are unlikely to be able to be reinfected, I think that's going to be quite helpful in, in terms of relaxing some of these restrictions. In La Crosse, Tyler Job, News 8 Now. Dr. Kenny also says that Gunderson Health System is aiming to conduct genome sequencing of COVID-19 patients in 21 counties in the weeks and months to come. Those are the counties that they're considering are in western Wisconsin, southeastern Minnesota, and also in northeastern Iowa. Mayo Clinic in Rochester is already analyzing plasma of some patients who have recovered from the coronavirus.